Hey guys, what's up? It's Danny V with Danny V Mobile Home TV. Coming back again today with another home tour. We're at Design Homes in Prairie du Chien, Wisconsin. So we got a smaller house right here. It's gonna be a more on the affordable side. Maybe it'll surprise us. Maybe it'll look bigger than it looks from outside. Hmm, this is nice. I like the colors in here. They pop very nice. We've got your kitchen right here. And then to the right of me, we got a pretty decent sized living room actually. That is surprising. I like that uh, chandelier, if you would call it that. We gonna come over in here, look at this island. And we've got area for storage down there. Outlets, one outlet, two outlet right there. I love the color of the cabinets and drawers. Nice, rich wood color we got we a space to put your dishwasher if you don't want to have a dishwasher you can just have you know extra storage right there you know for cabinet or or drawers or or whatever that's an option you can always option anything out of these houses because they're all custom houses oh not not uh, soft close on that one and you've got you know same thing over here it's gonna look like the same if i open up a cabinet so i don't want to do that and show you guys the same stuff, more you guys. So you got, you know, a space for an oven right here, and then there's a fan that'll blow out all the smoke and stuff outside. That's nice. Check this. Nice. Very nice size cabinet there. We got a back door right here, where you could have a garage or anything. One of these two doors is a way downstairs. One of them is just like a pantry probably. What do you think? This one goes downstairs, or that one goes downstairs? Number one, comment in the section below. Uh, number one, is this the one that goes downstairs, or is this one? Number two, one or two. I'll give you guys a second here to uh, go ahead and comment, and then I'll just pan back and look at all that room there. Lots of room. And I love that kitchen window above the sink. Okay, we got enough time there, I think. We'll check this door out, see what we have behind it. Door number two. Ooh, this one goes downstairs. Nice. This is wide. This is wider. This is a wider, you know, space that goes downstairs than I see in most of them. Got a nice light right there. Or you could have a crawl space, four foot crawl space. Might just put a full basement in. It's not really that much more expensive. And I'm assuming you could just put, uh, oh. Yeah, you come up, you got a door from outside right behind me, you know, and then you put your coats and hats and everything like that right in here and shoes if you choose to. It rhymes. Shoes if you choose. Shoes if you choose to. Let's come over here. The ceilings go up, you know, which makes it feel bigger. Probably a standard eight foot right here. Then that goes to like nine or nine or ten. It looks like a 10. You got nice thick outer walls, six inch walls right here. Okay, let's go in the bathroom here and see what we've got. Right here, it's just like a closet area. It looks like, oh, and you, nice. You put your washer and dryer right here and then you got shelving. So you got a washer and dryer, like exactly, pretty much right in the middle of the house. So, you know, you hear a ding ding or whatever, right when you're ch chilling in the living room. The washer and dryer are like feet away. That's, that's awesome. And if you wanted your, you know, washer and dryer hookups downstairs, you could do that if you wanted to and just use this space for something else or have them make it into something else. Maybe make the, the bathroom bigger or one of the bedrooms bigger to the side of the bathroom. Oh, I like this. Look at this nice marble. It's got nice swervy accents and stuff like that. I like that. And this is like a nice 3D beveled, you know, uh, two layered uh, space right there. It was nice. And look at all these lights right there. Big window or big mirror. You got a decent sized window right here. You've got a toilet. And we've got a shower with a shower head and a bath. Shower bath combo. Very nice. I don't know if I should go in this one or the other one first. It's a two bedroom. We'll go in this one. 
and you know it's a standard bedroom it's longer than it is wide it looks like you got a light right here you got your closet right here even got like a vent for your closet cool you got you know your shelving wood shelving right here as well all right <clears throat> i'm itching actually to see what it looks like in this other bedroom if it's going to be a um it's going to be bigger or the same size it looks to be the same size we got a light right there closet right here we got wood shelving here What I would do with this house is I would take the area out for the washer and dryer and then make this room or the other room um, use that space for maybe a master bathroom. It'd be a smaller master bathroom. Maybe I wouldn't do that, I'm not sure. I'd just probably make the bathroom or the bedroom bigger, probably. That's what I do. Yeah, yeah, I'd do that. Yeah, guys, look at this. We're all done. We're already with the video. This is a short video cut to the chase. I like the, the the flooring design on this one. It looks nice. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit the like button. That would be awesome. It'll show more people this video that are interested in a smaller modular home. All these homes are built to spec to Wisconsin codes that meets and exceeds the code. So rest assured these are built nice. I like these this big, fat, thick archway right here gives a character gives a home some character makes it feel very sturdy and if uh, you're not a subscriber go ahead and hit the subscribe button so then every time I do a video you guys can and hit the notification bell when you hit subscribe so then you get notifications every time I do a video the like button though is key if you guys just hit the like button that would be help out a lot so again thanks everybody for watching till the end I really appreciate you guys if you guys have any comments, questions, concerns for me, go ahead and drop those in the comment section. I'll answer you guys. I hope you have a great day. God bless. Take care. We will see you on the next video.